We know that a radian is a measure of an angle, and we've been dealing a lot with angles. So what exactly is a radian? Well, why don't we have a look at your curriculum? Your curriculum says that you should recognize the radian as an alternative unit to the degree for angle measurement. So far, so good. Define the radian measure of an angle as the length of the arc that subtends this angle at the center of the unit circle. Wow, what's that mean? Well, let's take a little bit different tack. We're going to be determining what the special angles are in terms of radians. And by the end of this activity, you should be able to convert from radians to degrees and back. And uh, all I'm going to do is tell you one radian measure, and then it's up to you to figure out the rest. So here we go. Notice that I have this set to rads. And as I'm going around the circle, you'll notice that I'm covering a certain amount of circumference. And when I get to... 360 and 360 degrees is 6.28 rads. You'll also notice that 180 is pi radians. So there are two pieces of information to help you. 360 degrees is 2 pi radians. 180 degrees is pi radians. And I'm going to leave it to you. Can you guess the radian equivalent of 90 degrees? And then can you find the radian equivalent of all of our other special angles?